Vicky was found as a tiny baby by some family friends. They thought she was a mouse, but when they brought her to me, I thought, that's a funny looking mouse. I soon realized that she was actually a woodland vole. When I first got her, she was so small that I had to use a tiny paintbrush dipped in formula to feed her. Once she was eating solid foods, she should have been ready to release back into the wild. I was expecting her to gradually become more independent, but she was super attached to me and always wanted to be picked up and carried around. When I learned that the majority of voles don't survive more than a few months in the wild, I decided that Vicky should stay with me and that I would give her the best life I could even if it was a short one. Her favorite thing to do is run up my sleeve and play inside my sweater. She'll sit in my hand and let me give her kisses, and she even purrs when she's really happy. She goes on lots of adventures, and sometimes we even do photo shoots. I built her a little amusement park, and she also has her own log cabin made of popsicle sticks. She just has the most adorable personality, and it even inspired me to write a storybook based on her life. I don't know a lot of voles, but I'm pretty sure that Vicky is one of a kind and that she is living the best life a vole could ever dream of.